It is nice and cool here at Mesquite High School. We're indoors at the best of basketball here in Gilbert. Uh, the several top high school teams throughout the state playing in front of college coaches and trying to convince their high school coaches they haven't picked up too many bad habits here in the summer league. Dozens of stories out here, but one story caught my eye, and that is a basketball player that's just happy to make it up and down the court. Derek Owens looks like your typical high school basketball player. The McClintock Charger point guard gets up and down the court with ease, but his story comes from the heart. Well, I had an enlarged aorta, so they had to cut out, or they had to shrink it to size, cut out the infected area, and I had a bicuspid aortic valve, so they had to replace that valve with a, a cow valve, also known as a bovine valve. Basically, you know, freeze me. I, was, my, I didn't have a heartbeat kind of thing, so... You can almost say I was dead, but not really. It's just something that I had to do in the procedure. I have to say, as a mom, watching him play and knowing he loved basketball, I could not let him play, and the doctors were saying it was safe to play, but as a mom, every time you went in strong to the basket, you're going, you know, or there's a hard foul, you know, your heart stops a little bit, and um, it's, it's a great relief now to know that he is just doing amazing. Derek's open heart procedure was in October of 2007. He missed his junior year because of the surgery. His parents have gone back and have petitioned the Arizona Interscholastic Association, the AIA, for a fifth year of high school basketball eligibility for their son. It's miraculous. I mean, really, truly, that, that he's able to play at this level, this competitive level of basketball, and having gone through what he went through, that type of a surgery... Um, I don't think, you know, many people, you know, would think that that's possible. Going through the medical process, I kind of want to do something involved in medical, maybe. Uh, so something through there would be nice, too. And if anything, I mean sports. Anyway, in sports, that'd be a dream, too. It's an impressive young man, and it'll be interesting in September to hear how the AIA rules on this case. First glance, you'd have to think they would give him the extra year of eligibility we shall see.